Why should I file ISF for American football wear? Have you ever wondered why filling out paperwork before your international shipment is as essential as throwing a touchdown pass? In the world of customs brokerage and international trade, the Importer Security Filing ISF, often dubbed the 10 plus 2 rule is a game changer. The ISF is a mandatory filing that importers must submit to U.S. Customs and Border Protection CBP, at least 24 hours before your container is loaded onto a ship bound for the United States. Just like any good game strategy, it's all about preparation and playing by the rules. Why file ISF for football wear? What's the big deal about filing ISF for American football wear? If you're in the business of importing jerseys, helmets, or other fan gear, this isn't just red type it's your ticket to compliance and avoiding penalties. Imagine picking up a ton of football merchandise to see it stuck in customs just because you didn't file your ISF correctly. It's the equivalent of fumbling at the one-yard line painful and entirely avoidable. The Requirements of ISF Now that we've set the stage, let's dive into the nitty-gritty requirements of ISF. You'll need to provide key pieces of information like the manufacturer's name, address, and a detailed description of the goods, which might include terms like synthetic bigger-than-life football jersey. This information helps CBP determine whether your goods pose a risk to the U.S. economy or safety. They want to keep out counterfeit products and threats, much like how a defense grips the offensive team. Timing is everything. Timing could make or break your football gear importation. You're not scoring points if you don't file the ISF at least 24 hours before loading, so make this a non-negotiable rule. If you miss that deadline, you could face hefty fines anywhere from $5,000 to $10,000 akin to getting a massive penalty for unsportsmanlike conduct. That's not only costly but also disrupts your supply chain. The Benefits of ISF Filing Now let's flip the story and talk about why filing ISF is like scoring a touchdown. Proper ISF filing can enhance your cargo's risk assessment. In other words, the sooner you play by the rules, the quicker your goods hit the shelves, and the better your relationship with CBP. When you file ISF correctly, you reduce the chances of unnecessary inspections. Not only does that save you time, but it also helps keep your goods moving smoothly through the supply chain, similar to an impressive play that sweeps past the defense. Consequences of Non-Compliance Neglecting your ISF responsibilities can bring dire consequences, like a rough tackle on the field. Aside from the financial penalties, you might face delays and seize goods. If your goods are detained, it's like being benched during a crucial game. And the longer it takes to resolve issues, the worse it is for your business reputation. Common Mistakes When Filing ISF As with any game, players often make missteps. Some common errors include incomplete or incorrect information, missing the filing deadline, or not understanding the requirements. Just like a bad play can cost a game, these errors can result in penalties or shipment delays. So, always double-check your filings after all, you wouldn't want a referee to overturn your impressive touchdown. The Role of Customs Brokers Here's where your secret weapon comes into play, Customs Brokers. Think of them as your unbeatable team manager, guiding you through the complex world of ISF with expert knowledge and strategies. They handle all the nitty-gritty details and paperwork, ensuring that your ISF filings are right on point. This means you can focus on what you do best like scouting the next best player for your fan gear line. Checking your ISF status. Once you've filed the ISF, how do you keep track of its status? You wouldn't want to be in a position where you realize too late that your filing was rejected. Most customs brokers keep you in the loop, but there are options to check with CBP too. Don't hesitate to dive into the digital world to track your goods after all, anticipation is part of the game. In conclusion, if you're planning to bring American football gear into the US, give the ISF filing the attention it deserves. Remember, it's not just a piece of paperwork, it's your game plan for smooth customs clearance. Understanding what you need, when to file it, and how to navigate the system will keep your shipments scoring touchdowns all season long. If you found this video enlightening or just enjoyed the puns, give us a thumbs up, subscribe for more content on customs brokerage, and turn on those notifications. Don't miss our upcoming videos where we continue to decode the complexities of international trade. Thanks for tuning in, and may your imports be smooth and your penalties non-existent. Thank you for watching, and we hope to see you in our upcoming videos. Check the disclaimer note posted down below.